Hello, everyone, and welcome to our channel. Today, we're delving into a crucial topic, dengue fever. We'll explore what dengue fever is, its symptoms, causes, prevention, and how to manage it effectively if you or someone you know contracts it. So, let's dive into this comprehensive guide on dengue fever. Dengue fever, often referred to as just dengue, is a mosquito-borne viral infection that can lead to a wide range of symptoms. These symptoms can vary from mild to severe, and in some cases, dengue can be life-threatening. So, what are the symptoms of dengue fever? Well, they can include a sudden high fever, severe headaches, joint and muscle pain, skin rash, and bleeding from the nose or gums. These symptoms typically appear 4-10 days after being bitten by an infected mosquito. Dengue is caused by the dengue virus, which is primarily transmitted to humans through the bite of infected female mosquitoes, primarily the Aedes aegypti mosquito. This mosquito is commonly found in tropical and subtropical regions, making dengue prevalent in many parts of the world. Preventing dengue fever starts with reducing your risk of mosquito bites. Using mosquito repellent, wearing long sleeves and pants, and using bed nets with insecticide-treated materials can help. It's also essential to eliminate breeding sites for mosquitoes by getting rid of standing water around your home. If you suspect you have dengue fever, it's crucial to see a healthcare provider for a proper diagnosis. There is no specific antiviral treatment for dengue, so management typically involves relieving symptoms. Pain relievers like acetaminophen can help reduce fever and alleviate pain. However, it's essential to avoid non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs NSAIDs, like ibuprofen and aspirin, as they can increase the risk of bleeding. In severe cases of dengue, especially dengue hemorrhagic fever or dengue shock syndrome, hospitalization may be necessary. These severe forms of dengue can lead to dangerously low blood platelet counts and increased vascular permeability, which can be life-threatening. Early detection and proper medical care are crucial in such cases. Apart from the medical aspect, coping with dengue can be emotionally challenging. The sudden onset of symptoms and the potential for severe illness can be frightening. Having a support network and staying informed about the disease can help you or your loved ones navigate this difficult period. In areas where dengue is endemic, community efforts play a vital role in prevention. Public health campaigns and mosquito control measures are essential for reducing the risk of dengue outbreaks. So basically, dengue fever is a significant health concern in many parts of the world, and understanding its symptoms, causes, prevention, and management is crucial. By taking proactive steps to prevent mosquito bites and seeking medical care when necessary, you can reduce the impact of dengue on your health and your community. If you found this video helpful or informative, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing to our channel for more health-related content. Thank you for joining us today. If you have any questions or topics you'd like us to cover in future videos, please leave them in the comments below. Until next time, take care of yourselves, and stay vigilant in the fight against dengue fever.